I was fucking around on my YouTube, right? And I found this little video, and it said Islam had a little trouble with drugs. But I don't see people talking about him. And so he was saying when he first came over that his school that he, he trained at in Russia, they just gave him vitamins, you know? They've been doing this since, since who knows when, when you start training. Imagine if you gave someone steroids from the age of 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, how strong you would be. People were like, like, he was really strong. It makes sense now. There's two people that I moved around with. I'm not going to say their names. But I was like, that's interesting. I moved with thousands of guys. That was interesting. I told my coach the same thing. There was something interesting about Islam. And I felt it. I'm like, it's just not human. It makes sense. If I could do drugs, like, because our countries are different. Russia's been banned for, for the Olympics, you know. Their country's a little bit more okay with the drug use. We're under strenuous, you know, under strenuous drug stuff over here. There, it's a little bit different. They're, they're behind their fighters. They want them to be stronger. They want them to be more manly. Over here, we don't. And it's just what it is. But imagine if I could do that. I would kill everybody, you know. And so it makes sense to me. Now, I wonder what the, why those Dagestanians were winning so much. They've been bred to do this. That's why I could train a nine-year-old against a bear. We've been doing this stuff since kids. They're, they've been bred to be better than us. I'm sorry. So they're going to win. It's just what it is. We, we're a little too pussyfied over here. You know, we can't do that. You can't do that. Those other countries are trying to do it. And that's why they're having so much more success.